Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Curse 3. Okay, we are gonna go upstairs next, but first, real quick, I also won't need this. I actually want to... Let's real quick, let's actually go back to the lab here. Now that I got two of these things, let's see if I can... what I can exactly do with these void energies. Can I take one of them and put them into this for, like, observation? Or is this already, like... See, I don't think this goes in here like this. This is if I capture the, the creatures, which I assume is when I use... Uh, which spell is it? In a weakened state, ensnared. So I think if I do that, I can then put them in the, in the thing there. I still don't know what this does. There's a good chance that I'll hardly use a lot of these spells, to be perfectly honest. And I don't know how much I'm going to actually use this Void Energy stuff. Because I'll put it this way. If this machine here, if these are necessary, then sure. But it, like for, for ammo and all that, like I can probably get by without doing it. So let's see what happens if I chuck this in here. Huh. Never mind. I can't... How do I make it get consumed? Drop item. Well, I don't want to. What does it say specifically? Concert, I'm sure somebody may have a use for this. See, like, can I like give it to my buddy like this? If I. Oh. Oh wow! A void crystal. I can already feel my power returning to me. Now I can help you even more. I could have had this earlier, I know, but it's fine. In addition to really revealing invisible things, I can also see an enemy's life essence. As long as I'm following you, I can see how close to death evil creatures are. Oh man, now I really wish I actually had used it earlier. Now then, let's go get him. Okay, so he gives me a vision about uh, the enemies. Whoa, who made all this neat stuff? Can I give him another one? What does it say? Upgrade, he also shows how much life enemies have remaining. He will not take it. Okay, so, the other spirit buddy, at least, uh, I can give that to. So, I guess the actual void energy that you get, uh, is, looks different, or whatever it is. I don't know. Again, I don't know how necessary, um, that is for completing the game. Or if it's just something extra. If it's just something more extra and I don't, uh, use it that much, well, yeah, so be it. I'm not gonna stress over whether or not I show 100% of everything. Uh, okay. We've got... How much time do we have till... Plenty of time. Our Zs are... Are adequate. And our inventory is good enough. Let's check up upstairs. Whoa, wait a second. I've seen two of these people before. Chapter 3, A Family's Fate. And you can't get here until you do Chapter 2 in the garage, so you couldn't skip because you needed the ladder. Bet other monsters won't be able to use that ladder. No, no way. I'm safe up here? Pasha and Pizzazz, I say. Okay, there's a lot of rooms up in here. Alright, well, let's start investigating. The third person is this girl I went to school with. The guy next to her was my dad's friend. His name's Spencer. See, okay, I'm pretty sure all those signatures were Spencer. They started with an S and then it was all like... Shrr. So the third person is the, is the girl. So that was the girl in Curse 2 that was tied up, which... I guess, canonically... You rescued her... You, know, you could rescue her, but then you would get captured by the cult. I would think that they would then capture her back. She may be actually dead. I don't know. Dad's friend, Spencer. Who are the other two? Uh, we'll turn that on just in case. Oh, it's a doggy! That dog kind of look, uh, looks like my childhood pet, Old Pear. Pear? Pear. But he was shaggier. That was in the backyard uh, in Curse 2 when you could dig up uh, one of the skulls. You could find uh, the remains of the pet there. Don't know if that, if the name is a reference to something. We were questioning that uh, during the Curse 2 stream. 
Picture frame broke and the photo is on the floor now. I don't recognize the person in it. Well, it looks like a it looks like a piece of shit. Like, what do you mean? Yeah, I don't recognize it either. Okay. Uh, first door. What do you see, buddy? I can feel a fellow void creature in the wall. Oh, thank thanks for that. Oh, hide under the bed? You bet. Classic. And then that's when the killer fucking eyes come into view as he fucking reams you. Oh, probably in there. Let's close that for now, shall we? Dude, our gun can hold so much. That is such a sweet upgrade bonus item. 100% worth it. Oh, another tape. Cassette tape with uh, S log written across the Spencer. Spencer's log? Okay. Get to learn more about him. Painting of a boat on a, on stormy seas. A couple matching tables surround the broken bed frame. Yeah, what happened on the bed here? Some people have some like fucking kinky sex. Went ham at it. Bed here is destroyed, but there's enough space for me to crawl underneath. Yeah, great. The lamp on the table looks destroyed. There's nothing inside it anymore. Why is the bulb like in the fucking wall? Like it. It, it exploded outward and the bulb just shot into the wall. Fan that is not plugged in. I don't see any outlets nearby. I also don't see any plug coming out of it. Or, you know. These wall panels feel loose or bent. I bet they could be pulled off. Uh, do I need the hammer? I need the hammer. Since we're right here. Uh, hammer time, hammer time. Where the fuck's my hammer? It's buried underneath something, some... Where's my hammer? Oh, it's in the... God damn it. Yeah, I ain't afraid of you. Uh, I ain't afraid. I need to heal. How close am I to leveling? Uh, still a bit to go. We will leave the board and nails, though. That I absolutely don't need elsewhere. Well, you know, I say that, but... I guess we can't be 100% sure about that. Uh, we'll keep the tape on our inventory just to remember we need to listen to it. I hear this music. This part is this part, especially right here. It, it makes me think of Daft Punk, or maybe something like for what was used in Tron, just like the beginning part there. I don't know. Maybe it's just because I, I came across some Tron videos on on YouTube recently. I don't know. Oh, hello there. Hello, Boppet. We get a new friend. Bo. She looks kind of grumpy. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Are you the trash that caught me? Excuse fucking me? It's my goddamn weapon. Excuse me? Wait a minute. You're not a demon. What's going on? Oh, she's got four eyes. Nerd. Slow down there. Let's talk about what's going on. Fine. But I'm watching you. Yeah, you watch me with all your fucking eyes. Are you an evil creature? Yeah, you can probably tell I'm not from this world. Some jackass caught me and sealed me away in that ruby thing. That's funny. Any idea who it was that kidnapped you? I bet you did it, you dirtbag. Yeah, I captured you and then I freed you. What the fuck would I do that for? Actually, I remember hearing a guy's voice when I was captured. So I guess it wasn't you. Yeah, thank you. At least you can use some reasoning. But still, I don't trust your kind. What do you mean, my kind? Are you actually friendly? Ha! I would destroy you in a second if I could, but I can't, so I guess I will let you live. Plus, you set me free, so there's that. I will keep myself hidden in this gem. I guess I'll tag along for a while if you call on me. Just don't call me friend. Well, okay. No problem. 
new bestest buddy. Gah, I hate you already. Oh man, this is, this is perfect. Are you going to help me too? Check this out, human. I am the best demon to travel with. Trust me. Oh yeah? What can you do? Don't let my cuteness fool you. I have a pretty sweet power. I can run up to any living thing and freeze it in place. Okay, that's actually pretty good. I like uh, games where you can like when you have like a free stun like ability like it's it's usually a pretty good thing. Uh, it takes me a few seconds to pull off, but it gives you a massive window for attack for some massive damage. Hey, that's pretty impressive. I gotta admit, I would definitely love to see that in action. I can't do it constantly, but still, I'm the coolest gal around. Haha, <laughs> maybe you are. I'm glad you're on my side. Do you have any other abilities? Actually, I used to be a little stronger, but my magic is weakened now. Without more raw void energy, I can't do much else. Alright. So I'm guessing the, the ones that we find, those packets of void energy, those are probably very specific items just purely for leveling them, uh, up the spirits. I would assume there's one for each, but not necessarily. Um, we'll see how much we use the other ones. Alrighty then, you're coming with me, right? Ugh, I guess so. Don't get used to it, Babaka. I will take off as soon as I get bored. Thanks. How do you work, though? That will case you stun, so I guess you, like, auto-do it? Uh... While we're exploring, let's have our buddy. Yes, he won't change, even though we've, we've now successfully gotten her. Uh, we shouldn't be in any danger, right? I'm not gonna attempt save. Well, you know what? What the hell does it matter? It comes back at a decent rate. Right? There may be no monsters, but there that doesn't mean that there isn't an insta-kill something up here somewhere. I am finding that this game in general, it has, so far, less of the jump scare factor, still good atmosphere, um, but it hasn't, uh, it hasn't had really deaths like two. Disaster Squad did say it's, it's a different game, and that's, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just, just an observation that I'm making. You know, it's fine. I'm, I'm enjoying playing this. A lot of smelly old, uh, <laughs> a lot of smelly old people clothes are hanging up in here. The closet a distinct aroma of mothballs. Right? Old people, look, Okay. Old people have a smell, or at least some do, right? And it's that old people smell. And I'm sure that something could be scientifically like explained as to like why it is or what the smell actually is. But just you know, look, my grandma's house had it. Okay, my grandma had the old person smell. Okay, I love my grandma to death. You know, rest in peace. But like, she had that smell. Okay, you know that smell, and you know that smell when you walk into a room. It's like, oh, an old person lives here. You just know. Oh, that's... all oh, arrows break its shield. Well, what in the world could this mean? I, gee, I wonder. Something up there has been painted over the ceiling. It's not high in here, so I can reach it. What do you see? Somebody painted over a doorway up there. Well, I mean, yeah, that was pretty obvious. Just a couple of clothes hooks on the wall. Just a random fucking leg over here. How you doing? It's like a weird, uh, it's a weird leg that feels like old leather. It has a kid's sock and shoe on it. Yeah, see, that's Justin. We've got two legs, a torso. We don't have the bottom half. Do we have both arms? I think we only have one arm. We don't, we didn't only, we only got one piece, uh, in the woods. The rest were other things. You know what? Who's, who am I kidding? That bothers me. <laughs> Let me fix that real quick. Anyone have that an obsession with their inventory, how it has to look a certain way? Everybody organizes their inventory differently in Resident Evil 4. Some group their ammo all together. I group my ammo next to the gun itself. Uh, my friend thinks I'm weird for that, but, you know, whatever. Okay, so... I don't want to go into the attic just yet. Um, so the master bedroom closet... Uh, red painted ceiling, attic, question mark, which it most likely is, but B 
big question is, how would we get up there? Somehow bring the ladder up with us? Again, I'm gonna worry about that later. Oh, that was just the music starting over again. Alright, what else we got here? Master bedroom, the closet. Let's just check out the bedroom, bedroom, and then the rec room. Okay, uh, let's see. Something doesn't feel right in here. Like I'm not alone. Oh, fuck. Okay, uh, hmm. You don't say. What do you see, buddy? The wall has a compartment in it. Maybe I shouldn't always... See, I want to hear his flavor text, though. Ah, it's fine. You know what? It's fine if he gives me hints. I don't really care, I guess. Colorful neon poster. Can I sleep in this? Wait. Yes, I can. Oh! Oh! Shh! Oh, oh god, I'm, I'm fucking dead. I'm dead. Why didn't I think about that? Why didn't I think about that? I'm so f I'm dead. This sleep is pointless. Uh-oh, we might actually get close to the minute hour too. Oh god, I'm I'm you won't get me with a scare. I'm ready though. I'm ready. Oh fuck. Fuck me. No. This was a mistake. Oh, I I fucked up. I done fucked up AA Ron. Shit, we're close to the fucking midnight midnight shenanigans. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> I thought I was going to wake up dead. Man, how do you wake up dead? You go to sleep and you wake up dead. I forget how the actual lines go. It's a funny thing from uh Was that from Was that from scary movie? One of them. Uh, bu -bu -bu, what am I doing? Dumping off more ammo. Keep that for now. The leg we can dump. And then we need to. We're gonna go board up. I just slept though. It's gonna. It's gonna. It's gonna take time to pass. You know what? We are not going to. Ah, I have, like, no fucking time. There's no time to, uh... There's no time to lose. Go back and investigate real quick while we can. Close the door. A lighter? A lighter! Standard Bic lighter is pretty much brand new looking. Uh, we can light the candles for a seance. As well as maybe the candles in the dining room just for basic light. Dress is pretty trash. There's very little in it. Poster of a graveyard and a campfire. Hey, The Wizard of Oz. The movie or the book? Well, it's in color. Well, that doesn't necessarily mean anything, but this poster is metal as hell. I wonder what that's actually, what that's actually from. Anything under the bed? Bed looks fine to sleep in when I'm more tired. I should probably make sure the room is secure, too. Yeah? Well, where's that fucking whatever? Some fucking Bering girl or something? Looks like a nice card or board game table. Oh, you were there! You were there! Hi! I saw you flicker. You gonna come up again? Oh, no, the mirror. Yeah, sure. Let me look in the mirror. This is a great idea. You see anything? I don't. Oh, she's there. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh God, she's she's in the room. Pink Floyd poster. This gal must have liked classic rock. Black Sabbath is okay, I guess, but I'm not that big into them. There's nothing of note in the dresser besides a lot of girl clothing. None of it would fit me. Oh, shit. What time is it? Oh, fuck. Uh, have fun, little girl. Uh, I'll be back later. You, you can kill me then. Quick. Uh, to the bedroom. Ah! 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 Fuck her. Ah! 
Ow! Oh, not good. Not cool. Okay. All right. Hold up. Who invited everybody in? No shit, Sherlock. He really has like a bad fortune cookie. That's really not cool. Fucker. That's the nice thing about the magic is I don't get s s locked into a fucking reload animation. That was a good burn. Oh, shit. Okay. Um, you guys know the drill. Um, I will cut to the midnight hour uh, being complete. Uh, we'll be right back. Oh my god, what the hell was that demon? Oh, Jesus. Well, at least I, uh, fucking only had to survive part of that. Alright. Drop that. You guys know the drill. First things first, get to... Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, ah! Uh, first things first, panic! I can't tempt save. Oh, God. Ah, uh, just, just, you, you fuck off for right now. Oh my god. Okay, hold up. Is that still there? No? Oh man, I... Oh, I kind of wanted to see what it was. What was that? Oh, now I'm just a little disappointed. You don't want to... You don't want to come back? No! I couldn't see it. Like, I couldn't even, like, turn my flashlight on. Well, shit. Well, I can't do anything about that now. Uh, boards. I need boards. That could be one of those random encounter things. I didn't want to have to redo the thing, which is why I didn't want to die to it. If it could kill at all, I assume it could. Unless it's just randomly roaming the house. My experience. Oh, we did level. Okay, uh, more Psyche. Probably could have used that just now. Uh, hmm. Alright, now our Psyche's really up there. What's the max level, I wonder? Oh, look at that MP recovery. That's pretty sweet. Alright. Well, I'm bound to miss something. Something or some things in this playthrough. It's just inevitable that I'll miss some scares or stuff like that. And it's kind of like, well, add them's the brakes. Can I use this in here? Uh, wait, not here. Where's the dining room? Oh, idiot. 
Ooh, how about this? Oh, this, this is great. No, I can't do it like that. Why do these rooms gotta be fucking dark? Oh, that's right, the microwave. I do need to do that, too. Okay, we'll keep the lighter on us for now. It's a small item. What were we doing? Oh, we were upstairs. Oh, we were upstairs with the, with the fucking girl who's gonna... Oh, well, now she has my permission to, uh, to, to kill me. A little girl, I'm back. You can come finish the job now. Oh, there's a big splotch, slightly different paint on the wall here. Yeah, but I mean, like, how do I... Have a time. Nope, that doesn't... That doesn't do a thing. What are the tools? I don't have, like, a... I don't have, like, a sledgehammer. Hey, you still there? Yeah, you are. Okay. Uh... Okay, so we're gonna put bedroom... Like the ghost zombie... Girls room. There's a wall... What, what did it say? Like a splotch? Whatever the hell. There's also a bed to sleep on, but that doesn't matter anymore. Let's keep exploring. Uh, let's... F oh my god! The fuck? Take this, you fiend! You get stunned. New stuff is spawning now. The god's eye draws them here. That blood trail is concerning. You blood trail? What blood trail? Blood trail? Oh, there's blood right here. Some sort of magic seal keeps me from being able to touch this door. There are three symbols on it. Oh, we're gonna have to refer back to that book. Okay, so the bedroom down this way is locked. So let's see, bedroom. Locked with three symbols. Oh, there we go, fucking light. You're not gonna comment about this? Come on, man. On Jen, what's wrong with you? She's like, ah, I've seen so much shit already. Long trail, but looks like blood goes from one door to another. Oh, fuck, it goes from the whole thing. It was harder to see in the dark like that. Oh. Oh, well, you know. You know, sometimes. I don't like. Let's close that, shall we? Two clothes ham. Two clothes hampers are full of dirty laundry and nothing else. Man, this is the kind of thing that you'd hide in when you're playing hide and seek as a kid. And then you get caught every time because everyone always looks there. Ooh. The dirty, smelly, crusty old rag. God, I hope nobody wiped their butt with it or, so or anything. No, I think they used it for something else, but I think I also know what this is for. We can have some fun with that later. Actually, how will we get to use it if I'm thinking what I'm thinking? Looks like something came out of that white chair. Oh god, there's a tub. I don't want to look in it. Towel hangs on the wall. It would only take up space. I'll leave it here. Wait, where did you say that was? Something came out of that white chair. White chair? He's referring to the toilet. He's just calling it a chair. Ooh, a knife. This knife looks like something I used to see in a uh, high school art class. It's very sharp. We can use this to cut the sofa or the chair. TP? No? No TP? I guess we don't need TP. Mirror works fine. I look at it and reflect on my time here. 
Yeah, well, is anything else in the reflection? This thing doesn't work, but I can fit under there and hide if I need to. Yeah, what does that look like? Yeah, great. Is that glowing red? Right? Is it just me? It's not, it's not perfect white. The rug and floor are covered in blood. That can't be a good thing. I know. Who's going to clean up this rug? This tub is massive and feels like something you would see in a castle. Can we turn it on? Nope. Oh, uh, well. I mean, I opened it. What did that do? The goggles, they did nothing. Now we let loose the demon from the toilet. Yeah, but... Can I really not investigate it more? That's really weird. Hmm. Alright, last room up here. Oh. Oh! Hi. Uh, we'll look at you last. Oh, Ouija board. Okay. Uh, we, I mean, we definitely have to perform some kind of seance. The question is, who are we going to talk to? Maybe Jack? Uh, the Ouija board. Yeah, sure. This is a uh, box Ouija board. I haven't seen one of these since I was in my teens. I have never used a Ouija board before. I probably wouldn't fuck with it now, just to be safe. Oh, hi. We can be Robin Hood. Uh, this shit massive. With this bow, I can attack without making any noise. I don't need to attract more monsters. Comes with a quiver. Alright. Well, we knew we were gonna find one. Shit's huge, though. Couch up here seems like it's still fine to at least sit on. This is a nice fireplace. It seems to be connected to the one below. That may or may not have relevance. See, some stuff like that could be flavor text, but it could also be part of a puzzle of some sort. Vines are growing out of the wall here. Uh, sure. Shotgun ammo. Nightstand feels like it's really sturdy. Uh, somebody was terrible at darts. Looks like... Looks like... Uh, <laughs> Looks like somebody sucks at archery if that's what they were aiming for. Oh, wait. No, those are arrows stuck in the thing. Oh, that's a puff of smoke. Oh, and then it stacks in the quiver. Oh, see, dang, that's kind of nice, because that saves sort of on, like, ammo space. Shotgun shells are eating up my space. At least all the handgun bullets are going in that. All right, time to look at the actual thing that's like here. Can I save real quick? Temp save. Just to have it at the ready. A huge carnivorous looking plant is in the corner minding its own business. I think I will keep my distance. No! Nope, can't keep my keep can't keep myself uh away. Oh darn. Okay, so oh. Any others to take out? No? I can't mess with it. Okay, so the last one, what is this? The rec room? There is a fireplace question mark, and then there's uh this plant thing. I'll fucking cut you. I'll cut you. I'll cut you real good. Alright, well... We gotta go back and look back at that book. Right? Did we miss what else was in there? Closet. Oh, to be able to go up. I don't know how we go up, up, though. Oh, 
God, we're going to perform a fucking seance. Uh, the Ouija board will drop you for right now. Uh, I'll drop those in a sec. I want the arrows because they all go in the quiver. So that's nice. All right. We have so many rifle bullets. It's, it's actually insane. Uh, shotgun shells. I don't know if I want the air, the bone arrow on me right now, though. Uh, just for right, for right now. We might mess with it later, but okay. This this needs to be in its own spot. It blocks way too much space otherwise. Uh, you know what? Let's use the knife because we know we can cut that thing. Uh, this rag will have to sit here for now. So the time is right to use it. I want to listen to the tape. Uh, let's see what else. Let's cut the. Oh wait a minute. There we go. What is this? Oh, this is the fucking rifle. Whoops. Uh, here. I recognize that sound effect. What's that from? Oh, it's a spirit. What newfound adversary is this? You should not find me easy prey, villain. Easy there. I'm not here to harm anybody. My name is Jen. Ah, the lady introduces herself. Where are my manners? Who the heck are you supposed to be? I'm a being from the other side, as you may describe it. I, however, have chosen not to fight, but to defend the weak. Seeing as my service was not welcomed by the other demons, I was entombed thusly. So you're saying monsters don't really like help from other monsters? I feel like they're all on the same team. I dare say they hate each other as bad as I hate them. How dare they banish me? But now I'm in your debt, my lady. Are you going to attack me? Alas, I'm afraid I cannot be considered your friend as much as, much as you may wish it. For I am now your guardian. As you have released me, I shall be better than a mere friend. I will pledge my fealty to you. Thus, your enemies are my enemies. Call me from this crystal any time you require my service. Now that's what I'm talking about. What can you do? Oh ho ho, as your humble servant, I will protect you with my life. If any of the scoundrels around here dare attempt to attack my lady from afar, I shall take up my mighty shield and bear the brunt of their fire. Only from afar? My lady, I'm afraid I am not equipped to defend against large attacks. My shield is only really fit to cast away projectiles. As long as I am currently ready. Uh, as long as I am currently ready, I, uh, it can take a little time to regain my courage. Thank you in advance, but I don't really want you to get hurt. What I'm doing is really dangerous so far. You underestimate me. My armor is quite impossible to crack, you see. I am completely safe, but you shall be slightly safer. If you happen upon a Void Crystal, I may be able to help you in more. Alright. I'm glad I can count on you, good sir. Think nothing of it, my lady. Er, now then, my lady, adventure awaits. Well. Did this just lose its luster? It did, didn't it? Is red all the indication of... Oh, oh, okay, so he's doing the layout a little differently here. Um, a valiant spirit who will attempt to block incoming enemy fire. I kind of like that. Hmm. I still can't get over the fact that I missed something in here. I should have. I should have just accepted it and just tried clicking him. We might run into him again. If not, well. Play the game yourself and see what, if uh, it pops up for you. I don't know. All right, let's not dawdle too much because time does tick while I'm thinking out loud here. Uh, it's six, but what is it? Is it bright out? No. Are we getting more towards the nighttime? It hasn't been that long, has it? Do I have to survive the witch call it again so soon? What else needed cutting? Didn't something else need cutting? Uh, the well. Let's try that as well as listen to the tape, right?
Did I just save? I might have just saved. Where is the tape? The study? Oh, and the computer should be on too. Let's see here. Okay, I put the tape in the player. This concludes my final log. I probably have to rewind it. Yeah, okay, rewind. Be kind, rewind. It looks to be pink tourlamine. I gave a piece of I gave a, I gave a piece to Shannon and the kids as gifts. Torm tourmaline. Tourmaline. What did I say? Tourmaline? Tourmaline? I don't know what the hell that is. Hopefully there was something. Come across anything pink? I'm also in the process of uncovering what could be a building underground. Okay, those are like the ruins or whatever. From right, it's almost twice the size of the entire lot. This could take a while. End of log. Captain's log. Star date 4567. Uh, here's more. Spencer here. May 2nd, 2009. Just a small personal update while I still dig out these ruins. My wife and I just found out that we will be having another child early next year. Now I have an even better reason to hurry up with my work here. Haha. <laughs> uh, well, we need to get to this, we need to get this place a little more infant friendly. That's pretty much it for now. And log. Yeah, well, that was what she's called, not uh, Bimmy, Pim, Pimmy, Pippy, Pippy. Dr. Spencer Carrington, July 8th, 2009. I just received a very troubling request from Tim back in his town. His daughter has gone missing and is assumed to be down in an off limits mine shaft. That place is heavily believed to be connected to lunar civilization. Okay, so the first game. I was called on specifically because of my knowledge of the site. Also, my lack of the town's superstitions. I assume Tim could think of nobody else to ask. We played as Spencer in the first game. This is a rare opportunity. They never let anyone down. They never let anyone down these tunnels. So first I find his lost kid. Then I document the entire site. I hope like hell she's okay down there. I'm getting ready to leave now. End of log. But Spencer died. No, there's more. He has to say that end of log thing. No, there's more. I'm waiting. I don't know what year it is. I finally made it back here, but my god. My wife has gone mad. Justin is dead. Sarah is missing. Oh, Sarah the little girl? They wanted the crystals. Those things are drawn to them. I don't know what to do. I have to lead somebody here. I have to hurry and leave behind any clues I can think of. Something is changing me. My mind is fading. Maybe he didn't die die? This concludes my final log, but he's been like corrupted or something? Or maybe he's turning undead or some shit? Okay, so that fills in some of the things from the first game because uh, in Cursed One, you're just like, you're the guy there and he asks you for help. You never get like introduced properly, as far as I recall. All right. So. Does that mean Spencer is alive in some form here? Is he the one roaming around? I mean, maybe? We need to look back at the book. We could probably turn on the computer. Oh, we're actually in the room with the books, but... We're getting close to the fucking 
No, we still have plenty of time until the midnight, uh, midnight shakedown. Ah, shit. Well, it's fine. I need to reload anyways. That's not how you draw a thunderbolt. Fuck! I need to hurry or other enemies will spawn. Fuck. Hey, at least my magic recovers quickly. Nope, nope, nope. Back up off on that. Walk into the fire! Yeah, you idiot. Fuck! Yeah, walk. There we go. Yeah, kill yourself. Alright, that was a, a rather sloppy display. Okay, so... Oh, I don't need this ammo. Uh, we're gonna keep the knife on us. We can go possibly cut the well in the back. Uh, but we'll come back to that maybe later. Um, only because... I should try to figure out the, the symbol thing, see if I can do anything with that. But I think we're just about at time here. So, uh, in the next video, we will try to see if we can figure out how to break that seal. We can go check the well. Um... And we're actually, we're going to start running, running into some, some dead ends here. Uh, I don't know how to get to the attic yet. See, the only thing I can think of is if we go upstairs, then pull the ladder up with us and then place it down again. But I don't, I don't think it's going to let us do that. So I might have to investigate it more. Anyways, we'll go ahead and continue exploring uh, what we can here in the next video.